Hello guys, um, in uh, this uh, video I will uh, bring you my issue after installing the uh, Ryzen 5 3600. It's not uh, something that cannot be solved but still you get a bit scared. Although it is a 6 core uh, and 12 thread CPU, in my uh, computer it shows that it's only a, a dual core with hyper threading. If I type in um, in MS config, and uh, I uh, open it as an administrator. You can see here in the boot section, advanced options, the number of processors, max is 4, although here it should be 12, full 12 threads. And I didn't knew why this uh, is, but uh, after looking on the web I saw that I need to download the Ryzen Master utility. So go on AMD's website, amd.com, or simply search Ryzen Master in Google. And uh, down here we can download it. Click on download now. It has 132 megabytes. Open the application and uh, click install. Agree with all the terms. Install also the Microsoft Visual C++ 2015. So if you get this issue, don't worry, it's just a matter of software installation. Now let's wait. Here it says that the uh, setup fail. Let's close it. I don't know that why that was. Let's try it again. Oh, here it is. Just wait for it. So don't double <laughs> install it over and over. Uh, click down, I agree to the terms and conditions. So you need to scroll down first, then click. It says a warning and click install. So just have patience. And now the uh, Ryzen Master uh, is uh, installing. Aside from the cable management and the um, aftermarket cooler, uh, this part, installing the old drivers, is really uh, another, a third hassle when uh, building a, uh, a new PC or when you switch platforms from Intel to AMD or the other way. It says that it was successfully installed and now we uh, need to exit and restart the computer in order to finish the installation. Exit, click exit and restart, which it does now.
and now we get this icon AMD Ryzen Master let's double click it and see what we get click OK this software is uh, also for overclocking but let's see if we can um, find the setting that will um, basically enable all the cores here it says simply reset the profile here we have down the reset button reset CPU parameters click on it it says that they are already in stock mode and there's nothing to reset click OK let's try restore defaults ok um, I will restart the PC right now and uh, see if uh, we will get any um, anything uh, different So with just a simple click you can uh, disable uh, any core OK, let's restart the system and see if this uh, Ryzen Master software installation solved anything the system is really quiet but when it boots up uh, I think it's the aftermarket uh, the AC Freezer 13 that uh, ramps like that Let's go in MS config and see if we get 12 threads. And something tells me that right now it will finally be as it should. You see by default this is what it should look like. 
they should show only one processor and when we click the number of processors and go here there we have it 12 threads so guys if you install the uh, Ryzen CPU especially in my case the uh, Ryzen 3000 CPU and you do not see all the threads all the uh, threads that it came with just install the AMD Ryzen master software OK apply OK and restart the PC in order to use all the 12 cores when uh, the uh, computer boots up Thank you, and uh, I'll catch you in the next one. Also, guys, in the task manager, I forgot to show you this. There it says 6 cores and 12 threads, 12 logical processors. Before it said 2 cores and 4 logical processors. Again, thank you, and uh, I'll catch you in the next one.